Yes. Welcome back to Path of the Inks. Welcome back to Gloomhaven. We mm -hmm. have returned to Gloomhaven. The Unbound Tempest is now milling around in Gloomhaven. <laughs> there they are. Um, so after the last adventure, uh, we now have this enchantress, enchanter woman yep. called Aesta. Aesta. Uh, Hail. Hail. Yeah. That's her name. Hail. Mm -hmm. So, we need to say where we're going to go next. Yes. Yes. Um, so we have some new locations in the last time. So we had the Drake's Rest, uh, the Forgotten Crypts, and... And um, the uh, Plane of Night. No, we can't go to the Plane of Night until we've got an artifact with the, check, the requirements for the three. Oh. So that one's out for now. But we can go to the... Uh, Verdant Grosso. Right. No, we couldn't go before because we were waiting to get the mm. power and enhance, enhancement, enchantment. Is it enhancement? Enhancement. Power of enhancement, yeah? Yes. That's right. Power of enhancement. Uh, which we now have, so we could go there. Uh, we could also still go down the bottom of the map down here where we've got the uh, Temple of the Seer, which was the other option from last time. Right. As well as the couple of random dungeons, 67, I think it was 71. But I'm um, wondering if we should wait for that. I, th I think we should really. Yeah. Right. Uh, another news. I spent my perk from last time on ignoring negative scenario effects because I'm a big coward. So <laughs> I can now ignore any negative scenario okay. effects. Um, while we were in town, I gave some money to the Temple of the Great Oak. Right, so you've got... So uh, I went from 43 gold to 33 gold. So you need... Two blessings? To add those to your... Okay. I'm not spending any gold this time, just because I don't have a great deal. I didn't earn any in the last game, due to my... Um, well, what your... My attempting to not gain any money because <laughs> I was being indignant. I don't need money. I don't need money. So, uh, yeah. So, where do you feel, feel like going? Um. Um. What's this one down here? The. Number 19. What's number 19? That's the Forgotten Crypts. Forgotten Crypts. Mm. Yeah. Might be a bit frightening, that. It might, but Jack Sarah's a necromancer, isn't she? She is. So, what I was thinking, maybe that's the one to go for. You think she's going to be there? Possibly. We're after, we're after, after killing her, and Forgotten Crypts is where you get you know, like necromancy stuff from. Mm -hmm. The Drake's Nest. I don't know what's there. What's that We've one? been to Dagger Forest before though, haven't we? Yeah. 27 was the random one, the Arcane Library. The first random we got. Mm. Um, this is Verdant Grawl. I, I, I feel either we need to go to the Verdant Grawl or the Forgotten Crypts. I think those two feel to me like they'd be the most um, beneficial. Mm -hmm. You don't know nothing about it. Just because it feels like that's where the story's taking us. What do you think? I think it's one of the crypts, yeah. Crypts. Wrong crypts? Yeah. Right, we do need to do a city event. Right, okay. Uh, and a road event, so if you want to pull out a city card. Okay. Right. While enjoying your customary post-adventure drink at the Sleeping Lion... It is you... customary as well. It we, is, yeah. We do do that now. We do. You notice something weird going on with the lamps in the bar. Okay. Your first thought is that it's your imagination. After staring at the lamps intently, you see they are flickering in and out. Tech lamps, as opposed to normal gas-burning ones, have been known to be a bit unreliable. Uh -huh. As if on cue, the lamps suddenly go out completely, leaving the room pitch black. So, option A. Guard my time. <laughs> Offer to fix the lamps. Shouldn't be too hard with a bit of technical know-how. I don't have any technical know-how. <laughs> I'm a rock man. O option B. Take the opportunity to steal some valuables from drunk patrons in the dark. Oh, okay. 
Well, we've been pretty good with these characters. We've not been really Evil nasty or anything. Nasty or anything. Uh, maybe we just... What do you think? See, I think it's a trap that they've turned the lights down. It's as soon as trap. we start running around nicking things, the lights, the lights are going to go... Of around this one's yeah, pocket. exactly. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it reminds me of uh, that film Gaslight, that you know, the one with Ingrid Bergman, a really old black and white film. It is, <laughs> yeah, I've heard of it. Yeah, I think I've seen it. Mm, what do you think? I think we should offer to fix the lamps because I can guarantee yeah. that we'll start. I shall hit the lamps with my fists of rock and actually get them. Uh, okay, going so in. we're going with option A, yeah, okay. You quickly identify the source of the problem, some frayed wiring in the kitchen, and have replaced it in no time. The proprietor seems very impressed by your work and gives free drinks all round in your name. Hey! Gain two reputation. Oh! Nice. So what, reputation plus nine, eh? Mm-hmm. Cool. Oh, hang on. So What's the cog? Cog. That's the tinkerer, I think. Oh, right, so we don't have that then, do we? No. Oh, right, so uh, no, no effect then. What, the other one? Yeah, you fumble around oh. magnanimously for a while before concluding that You've you have lied no idea. I didn't realise what the cog meant, you sorry. Lied to, lied to. You, you fumble about magnanimously for a while before concluding that you have no idea what you're doing. The proprietor looks very disappointed and sends out for a real tinkerer. No effect. Sorry. We're back on seven. <laughs> right. My bad. It's all right. So we're going to travel from Gloomhaven, which is here, to do, 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 down to the swamps. I'm going to go on a straight line. <laughs> so the road. The road is long. Not far outside Gloomhaven, you look and see a large flying bird. Not more birds. Oh. Something is odd. It's Superman. <laughs> uh, something is odd, though. Its movements are jerky and there is smoke billowing out of it. That's not bird. Bird. <laughs> <laughs> Then you see it plunge into a sudden nosedive and crash into the ground off to the east. You rush quickly to the scene to find a limping suit-covered quattrill kicking a giant wing contraption made of leather and metal. Curse this wretched thing, he yells in frustration. I thought I'd worked it out, and then I suddenly lost pressure in the piston chamber. Ooh, mm. sounds painful. You don't. It looks, he looks over at you. You there, wonderful timing. Help me to get this thing back into there. There is no time to waste. So we can do whatever the quattrill says, mm. or we can demand an explanation before you help him in any way. I think we demand an explanation before we go helping him out. I mean, what's the point? He's just crashed. <laughs> Demand an explanation. Think we should demand an explanation. What do you think? Uh, What's the point in helping him out? He's just crashed. I do want to help him out. It's, 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 it's like it's, it's man or quadrant flight. You know, it's it's the, it's, it's the dream. <laughs> to soar like a bird. Okay. What do you reckon? What do you? B. B. You're gonna go for B. Demand an explanation. Okay. Yeah, let's go for it. Was that the car, the destroyed car? It then? was, was it? yeah. yeah. Okay. So. so we're demanding an explanation. Mm -hmm. Okay. You force the quattro to slow down and talk to you, but his eyes keep darting around in a panic. Don't you understand? The world needs my technology now. I'm. It must be perfect. It will revolutionise everything. You agree that the power of light is pretty great, but you convince the Quattro that the world can wait a day for him to get some rest, organise his thoughts, and you help him transport the broken machine back to town. Hmm. Okay. Do you know what we get? Go on. Gain one prosperity. Oh! That's not bad. That's not bad at all. It's not too shabby. I think you made the right choice, though. So what's prosperity of women over now? Uh, we're just Ooh. below two. It's nearly at two. Nearly. Right, so that's a destroyed card as well. Right, okay, I'll put them in the in the box then. Yeah. Right, okay, so 
Uh, we'll set up the dungeon for the Forgotten Crypt and we can find out what the heck we're doing. Go back and show the answer of these notes. I've been quite powerful enough to do this one yet. Okay. So we are here. We've deployed here. This yeah. token is a uh, hail. The other three tokens are event tokens. Uh, well, there's another one there. That's the altar at the top. That's where we're trying to get to. Right, okay. Um, so, yeah, I'll get to the special rules. I'll read the introduction. So, you want to do what now? Hale stares at you blankly. You find a rift into the plane of elemental power and you want to close it, she sighs. Why did I agree to help you? Hale begins tossing the orb you retrieved up and down in, th in thought. Okay, based on your description, it's going to take a little extra work to close a rift of that magnitude. I could do it myself, but it would take a while, and it may get troublesome. If we were attacked by the other side in the middle of this incantation, it would be much easier to do if I had an elemental sensor, which is really entirely too convenient, because I've been wanting to get my hands on one for my studies anyway. I know of a powerful elementalist who owned one many years ago. He's dead now, but I'll take you to his crypt. Personally, I'd advise against handling the sensor on your own. After a day's journey, you find an ancient overgrown mausoleum resting along Serpent's Kiss River. Stonebreaker really was a nice fellow. Getting crushed by massive boulders is just one of the hazards of being an elementalist, though. After clearing away the overgrown vines, you head down into the crypt. Oh, great hell, sirs. These blasted cultists are everywhere. Probably looking for the sensor too, or they simply don't want you to have it. You look at hell with confusion. And she points into the shadows where dark figures in black robes start to emerge. You shouldn't have come here, ghost face, says one of them. Ghost face. The hell size. Dispatch these simpletons quickly, I'm bored with them already. <laughs> okay. Yay! So in the first dungeon we need two cultists. Two normal cultists. Normal cultists. Two normal cultists. Two normals. Normal. Right. Tell you what this reminds me of. What's that? Cthulhu. Cthulhu. And the cultists. Oh. So is that what they're summoning? Cthulhu? Yeah, how can I help them? <laughs> <laughs> is there an option to is option B help the cultists summon Cthulhu? Yeah. Oh. Right. Okay, so we're away, basically. Mm -hmm. This is it. Come on, a minute to have a break. Shall we go? Let's go for it. Let's go. Okay. Too cool to say. Mm -hmm. That's a good one, isn't it? Okay. I'm going somewhere in the middle of the wreck. Right, I imagine. Okay. Uh, my attempt is to like see me sort of like grappling and doing all the actions and even when I'm about to throw something really heavy and <laughs> something. Okay, so you don't want me in the way basically, is that what you're trying to tell me? Yeah, you know that this might give off a bit of splash damage from experience. I'm just saying. Okay. In which case, then I'll go for um, a ranged attack then. 
Okay. Yeah. Uh, so my initiative will be 46. Oh, I want them with a poison strike and a uh, massive boulder. Okay, so my initiative will be 8 and I'll be attacking at range using Perverse Edge. Yes. And then I will be augmenting myself. Yes. Don't blame me. Okay, so we need, uh, what's the cultists? I've just realised that is the wrong one. So we've got seven wounds. I do apologise, I'm just going to swap that one out. Two. Put the wrong one down. I didn't see anything. <coughs> I, I put the wrong one down. No the cultists are going at ten. I'm going at eight, so... So you, the cultists, <laughs> and me. Yeah. You, the cultists, and me. Mm -hmm. That does sound like a song. It does, doesn't it? You, the cultist, and me. <laughs> it's like a folk song, yeah. isn't it? <laughs> right, off your pot. Okay, so I'm going to use this attack, first yeah. of all. Yeah, so it's a ranged attack of two, so cultist number one is in range. Are you right there? Yeah, I just forgot to have a look at the special rules. Oh, right. Just for moving her. Oh right, okay. Yeah. So you um, added three curse cards to your deck, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Cool. I didn't add them to my because I've got that uh, perk now that ignores them. Oh right, yeah. Yeah. Right, so I've got um, attack one, range of two. Um, so that's what he's got coming in at him. Plus two. Yowch. Um, and frost goes up into ascends. Frosty. <laughs> Um, I got a point for that, I think. Nice. Yeah. Good How many so wins have you caused him? Uh, so, three. Three off the bat? Mm-hmm. Because nice. it's, it's one plus two, so three. Yep. So he's, he's suffered three <laughs> wins. Okay, so that's that one done. And then I'm just going to augment myself. Mm-hmm. Okay. You're augmenting. Uh, I'm augmenting. So it's myself. them now. So they move minus one. What's their movement? Uh, their two. movement is um, two. So, right, can so move he one. will move one. twice. Uh, he'll move twice. So yeah. Then attack minus one. So the attack is one anyway, so nothing. Okay. <laughs> What's this? On death. They explode. Is that what that's oh, great. Is that, is that what that's actually saying? That's what that's saying, isn't it? Is that because it literally got an early attack on death? So if they die this round... So if they die, they get yeah. a, a two attack plus two, and then everyone in that surrounding area yeah. gets the damage. Yeah. Okay. Oh, wow. Good job I didn't Ooh. do that then, wasn't it? Great. Right, okay. Uh, so I'm going to get this out there already. So that's now using. We've got to retaliate. Mm -hmm. Show me out. There we go. Put that there. Right, and I'm going to follow up with a massive boulder. Ba boom. I'm going to target it at that guy. Ooh. That guy. So that guy. Yeah. So there's three, plus nothing, damage. So just three damage? Three damage. And that's number two. That's number two. Yeah. And then splash damage hits you the guy and hits him for one. Mm. And that is me done. Right. So we'll be back to Oops. choosing what we're going to do. Um <laughs> okay. Their initiative if that's like sort of their initiative they'll be going for ID, won't they? Mm-hmm. 
I mean, they're probably close to me than I want them to be. We're a bit closed in here now because of these pillars. We are. Uh, let's give myself some options. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, forgot to ascend that last so. time. So both frost and earth are waning. Yeah, okay. Right, okay. I think I've got what I'm going to do. Yeah. So I am going at initiative um, 35. Um, and my plan is to. I shouldn't have told you what the initiative was. <laughs> so I'm just gonna. I'll tell you my plan just to make up for it. <laughs> okay. Um, well, I was gonna move around a little bit. Yeah. To get a bit closer to the door in case we needed to. Yeah. Um, and while I'm doing that, I'm hoping to oh. get at least an attack in. Too many somewhere. moving parts. So she would have moved two. All right. Uh, I'd, I'd, I presume around the mobs or mm -hmm. through us, so I've got around the mobs. Yeah. yeah. So I'm hoping on the way past I'm going to one of them. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So I'll be going mid range. Shall, shall we see when they move? Yes. So I'm going initiative 35, surprise. So they're going at 10. Yeah. Uh, uh, I'm using Crushing Grasp for my initiative. I'm going at 20. And I've got Crater up and down. But they're yeah. going first. They're going first. <laughs> So, they move minus one. one which so he's not going to move. Just one. Be will. Yeah. Um, and then attack one, and then on death they explode. Yeah, but so, the attack still one, so it's still minus one. So there's nothing. Nothing. Attack one. I thought it'd be a problem if it was an elite. No, it, it wouldn't. One. It'd be alright if it was elite. I think they just want to explode in their faces. I think they do. That, that's the thing. We're yeah. going to have to get them at range, aren't we? So we don't. Yeah, it's not. <laughs> he says. Okay. Um, so she. Okay, so I'm going to use the move three here. So. Move through her, can't I? Yeah, you can move through her, she's not. One, two, three. Yeah. And attack for one. Yep. Within a millimeter. Oh, times two. And. Two coming at them. Yeah. Oh dear. How many is that? So that's one, two, three, four, five. Five damage? Five damage. Yeah. He's yeah. Just, so he's just exploded. Yeah. <laughs> Can't let a death start. Uh, yeah. So um, flip an attack against yourself plus two. Minus one. Oh, one wound. Not so bad. Now flip an attack against this guy. For, for me? No, for it's because he's in the explosion round. Plus zero. No, so he takes two wounds. Two wounds? Yeah. So that'll be five, won't it? Yeah. He's on. And he's dead. <laughs> yep. Good to do. Uh, okay. Yeah. Um, okay. Um, and then, what was the other one? I was going to move two. Yeah. So I can still move two. Yeah. Where do I move two then? Do I move near the door, do you think? Or? I'm just doing this and talking to that. <laughs> where are you moving to? I only, I only need to move one, don't I? Listen, no, tell to yourself where you move. I'm not going to influence it whatsoever. Okay. Because I've already got it wrong by saying what they need to do. Okay. Where have you gone? Oh, I can work with that. Uh, right, is it me? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I'm going to go blip blip. And I'm going to lob a crater at this guy. Right. <clears throat> so attack three. Mm-hmm. Plus, that goes into ascendance. Frost. I'm also using it. So Frost needs to go down, doesn't it? So, yeah, it goes down at the end of this turn. All right. Plus nothing. So he takes three damage and gets pushed back. 
Well, he's already, he, he's gone. So he explodes into the wall. <laughs> Damage everywhere. I'll move them down to the end of the turn. There's bits of cultists, cultists absolutely everywhere. everywhere. And I get an XP for that as well. Well done. For using a bit of earth. Those two are gone. Okay. So does she move as well? She moves two towards the door. Two. Which she'll open next to her automatically. Okay. Regardless of what we do, so we may as well open the bloody door. Okay. <laughs> Exploding cultists. <laughs> Sorry, it's my amusement. Great. <laughs> right. Uh, I guess we're going through this door. I guess we're going through it whether we like it or not. Basically. Tell you what, we didn't put down. Though. Did you? Oh no! Did didn't you put, pick up? I coin didn't. From before? No, I didn't. Where was the other cultist when he blew up? I think he was there, it? wasn't he? Yeah. We didn't. We didn't, we didn't put him down. down. No. Right. Okey doke. Uh, so I guess I'm making my way towards the door, mm -hmm. lumbering over. Let's see what we got. Something like that, maybe. And oh, I don't know. Let's see. Uh, yeah, as well. So, what does this mean? Let's see. You know what? Uh, we'll find out. Okay. <clears throat> Later on, we open door number one, which is actually that one. Oh, okay. Great. Yeah. <laughs> Right, um, so I'm going fairly early for me, I suppose, in the great scheme of things. And I'm sort of lumbering towards the door. Okay. Readying myself to sort of launch attacks, anything that may be through there. Um, right, okay, I, I'm going to do the same. I'm going to wander behind you and go fairly early on and hope that I've got something in case there's anything in the next room. Okay. So my initiative's 38. Okay, mine's nine. I'll use the nine. Yep, so you'll be going first. Two. Okay. You're going. So I'm going to go and open the door. Yeah. So one, two. That's your movement. That's my movement. Is that where you're ending as well? Yes. So you'll be picking that coin up. I can also heal two, but I only need to heal one. So that's that one done. You open the door then? I'll open the door. Real sound effect. <laughs> um, so we have some boulders there in the way. We have two cultists. And we also have a living bones. Um, is that a normal or elite? Or normal. Normal. Normal living bones. Uh, where are these dudes? I'm going to put that in the wrong place. No? Oh, yes. Yeah. There was living bones, where did he go? He's hiding there. Right. So, no. Okay. Yep. So what are you doing with the rest of you? Um, well, I've got a ranged attack. What's the range? Four. Oh. So I might be able to hit yeah, number two. Yeah, that is in range. Yeah, so um, it's attack uh, two, it immobilises, frost goes up into ascendance and I get a XP for it. So let me see what we get. Minus one, so it's just got one coming in at him. So what's your number? T number two. So that's one. one. And he's immobilised. He's immobilised. This is good news. Uh, we do need to f f uh, flip an initiative for these two guys before so we do anything else. Put that there. Right. Um, so cultist, twenty-seven. Yeah. And living bones. 20. We have twenty. So these are all going before me. Uh, so living bones will be one next, won't he? Yes. Yeah, minus so two minus to his two move. Moves, so he moves one. Sort of ambles over here. Ambles. It's nice. Well, by attacking himself. Maybe. And a healing no. himself. And then which... healing himself. Yeah. Who knows? 
Uh, and then we're on to the cultists. Cultists. Only one of them can move, though, can't they? Yeah. So they don't have, they have a range attack. Uh, no range attacks. Uh, movement of two. So he's going to amble. So you've got bam bam. Onto yeah. Whatever that is. Whatever that is. Explodes like a Death Star. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, that'll need shuffling now as well. So you get rid of it. Was it me? Finally. Uh, right. Meh. Not much I can do actually from where I am. Um, so, one, two. Is, is there. Um, can I draw a line of sight from the, through the door to him, can I? Because I can draw a line of sight to that point, haven't I? Yeah. Okay. So I'll use my dirt to touch to actually move. Okay. Uh, I can't let me move. Actually, the other one probably moved. Oh, I moved two, didn't I? Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's do it. So I'll use that one just to use the two movement on instead. Right. And I'll dirt tornado them. Dirt tornado. Oh, <laughs> hit those two basically. Okay. And that was still where it was meant to be. So I can use that to again plus one to my attack. Okay, so one to oh no I'm not in range. Yeah. I'll have to go back to my original thought. Because there's only range two. <laughs> this is why I was going to use this in the first place. So I'll move with that one and I'll attack with this one. So it's just the one guy. Mm -hmm. But I still use that. Uh, so it's attack two, range five. So he's in range. Yep. Attack two, plus one. Mm -hmm. So that's three wounds. On um, number, number one. He's also immobilized. Oh, nice. And again, an XP. Um. Mobilisation next to him. Right. And that's the end of that chapter. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. Right. Yep. And she moved two. She moves two, so she'll be stood in the door. Okay. Hold on. Okay, I'm eyeing up those rocks in the middle of the room a bit dubiously and I'll be going mid round really, to be honest. Okay. I'm probably gonna go mid round as well and I'm hoping to uh move in and do a bit of uh hitting. So my is just forty one with rock tunnel. I've also got seventeen grill. Okay, mine's going to be 29, so I'm going to be um, just moving mm -hmm. in, and then I'm going to be attacking, but because one of them's got a negative condition yeah. on them, um, I get an extra plus, uh, plus one to my attack, yeah, so each what, negative condition. I need to pull their initiatives. So, cultists, yep. it's 27, again. Moving attack. And, and living bones. Is attack. attack. 45. 45. So what's your initiative? Um, 29. 29, so oh, cultists are going to be moving first, aren't they? Well, they can't move because they're both immobilised. Oh, that's true, so... And they can't attack because there's no range of attacks. So just, just stand there like prunes. No, yeah. it's your turn. Okay. <laughs> so I'm going to use that one just to move in for two. Yeah. So one, two. Yeah. And this guy, I'm going to attack for two. Add... Yeah. Plus one attack for each negative condition, so that's I'm going to be hitting for one. three. Yeah, three. Yeah. And then me melee attacks add another one. two on there. So that's five. Five. Plus whatever you. Well, four. Right, four. Four. And it's cultist number. 
One. So he's so. dead. <laughs> no, it just explodes. <laughs> Does he explode? No. No? He just no. dies. He just dies. He, he didn't arm his uh, cultist. Oh, he didn't press his... Arcane bomb or whatever Yeah. He didn't press the button. Uh, coin. 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 Cha-ching. Uh, put that there. Cha-ching. Just put it on top. So. Wait. Um. Oh, yeah. And I need to put that in there. Is that your turn? That's my turn, Bob. Okay. Right. So I'm going to use my boots of striding. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to couple that with... Um, Seventeenth growth movement of two. So one, two, three, four. Which gets me to there. Have you got any wounds on you? Um no. Oh, okay. Uh so that heals you and me for one, even though neither of us take any damage. And now I'm gonna smash this obstacle out of because I don't like the look of it. Okay. Using rock tunnel. It's top ability. Getting an XP. Just for doing it. Fair enough. Kaboom. Now I can see that guy. <laughs> I see you. Right, so now he moves, and what's his movement? Um, his movement is um, three. Three. Mm -hmm. That's fine. That's because he'll come straight for me. Uh, he attacks. He's two. So you want to flip? Plus one, so that's three. Three. I'll take the damage, and he takes two in return from my retaliate. All oh, right, so it's worth noting he's got um, a target. Of, he can target two of us, and he's got a shield of one. Right, so we don't we make sure we both don't stand next to him. Yeah. <laughs> he's got a shield of one. One. Right. Yeah, we must remember that. Right. Okie dokie. Right, I've so got a shield of one. That I'm comes off. That, that will come off now, won't it? Uh, yeah, it's gone. Yeah, it's gone. Right. I've got, I've got two cards left, and then I'll have to do um, a, um, a rest. So I've got yeah. one action left, and I, I will have to do a rest. All right. Yeah, I've got this turn, next turn, and I have to do a long rest. If I don't do a short rest before that. Uh, In fact, when you do a short rest, we've never actually done a short rest. We so haven't actually done this. We sort of play through, don't we? Mm. Play through the barrier. So, short rest, play two cards. But it just means losing a random card. Mm. See, that's a danger, isn't it? Mm. That's why it puts me off. Anyway, I'm going as early as I possibly can, for me. Right. And I'm I'm looking really angry at this this skeleton. I don't like that. Okay. Um, we didn't move. What's the face either? Did we? No. She stood there. Right. <laughs> Just for reference. Okay, I'm gonna probably move away from you. And I just don't like this cultist. So I'm gonna go early-ish. Yeah? Yeah, I'm hoping early-ish. Early-ish. Do you want to... Well, my initiative's going to be... Um, sorry. It's going to be 29. Mine's going to be 27. Do you want to flip for that? For the cultist? So they will attack Hale, by the way. Oh, right. I'm okay. just checking. Ah. Uh, she has two times the level hit points. Four plus two times the level. Right, so... So she's got eight hit points. Oh, okay. Uh, she's not allowed to, you know... So the cultist right. is going up 39. It's just you know what you're saying, it'll target people next to him. Yeah. So you'll target her. If... Right. Uh, cultist is going 39, living bones are going at 12. 12? Mm-hmm. Oh, that's only shielding himself. And healing for two. Oh. So that's both of his wounds gone. So he'll go first one. Yeah. So, so he's here. shielded. And he heals. So he's now got two shields. Yeah. This is more difficult. Yeah. At least he didn't attack. <laughs> no, that's true. 
Right. And then it's me for uh, 27. Yes. Yeah. So I'm going to use the movement on here to move two. Mm -hmm. So I might just go to here. Yeah. Um, and my attack on there. And then um, I'm going to use the attack from here to attack for two. Yeah. Yeah. So plus one and plus two from there. So that's one, two, three, four. Four, oh, four yeah. coming at him. Yeah. So that's five wounds he's got on him. Two left, is it? Two left. Okay, yeah. what what's the cultist going on? Thirty nine. Yeah. Okay. So is it me next? Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to um I'll just pick up that coin. Yeah. I'm going to do a heavy swing into his face. Okay. So I'm hoping for a good card now. Push that into ascendance. Plus one. So he takes two wounds basically. He gets pushed back. <coughs> and oh man. To the normally, not using the rumbling advance ability. I don't want to injure Hale. <laughs> right, okay. Um, cultist is going to have a go now, isn't he? Yeah. So he's got. He's not going to move, is he? Well, he's, no, uh, there's no point in him moving. Minus no. one. So he'll do a heal after he does an attack. Yeah. So he's going to roll, 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 flip. Minus time. one, so nothing. Nothing. And, and then he one. just heals one, so. He's all back on four. I just realised I used the cards the wrong way round. Did you? Yeah, I used my cards the wrong way round. Ah. Because I could have probably killed him. Ah. Had I done it right. That was my fault. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So she'll move two towards the door. So she'll just move through and me to the... Okay. Yeah. Yep. Okay. They need to be shuffled. Yep. So I need to do a long rest to get my cards back. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um. Oh, great. I need to do a long rest as well because these cards are going to do nothing for me in the situation I'm in. Yeah, this hasn't worked out very well. <laughs> so that's it. Right, uh, so shall I have turn for them? Sorry? Turn for these guys. Yeah. If we're going at 99. So he's going at 63. And Living Bones is going at 74. So Cultist has summoned a normal Living Bones. Oh, for goodness and the sake. Cultist suffers two damage. So that's. Six. Well, that's silly of him because he's only got one hit point left. Yeah, his own bonds are worse than cultists. Yeah. So he's summoned. What do we put him next to him, do you reckon? Yeah. Here? Yeah. Yeah. Um... And long bonds go. Hey. This isn't great. No. So they don't Target. move, but they do an attack. Yeah, target one enemy with... Oh, target oh, one enemy God with all that. attacks. Right, so... Go for that. Because i got... Oh, wait a minute. Which, well, we get to choose if it's equal initiative. She's got a 99 and I'm going at 99. So I'll choose myself, obviously. Yeah. So do you want to go for number one first? Yeah, so flip. Minus one. 
Oh, it's one loss is attack. Two, so one hit point one. coming at you. I'll not worry about that because since I'm resting, that takes and then he's going to come at me. Yeah. So plus one. Oh. Uh, but I've got my armour. Yeah, so your armour so ignores one of those. So my armour ignores one of those. Chink. And I just take one hit, don't I? Yeah. That's fine. Okie dokie. And I get all these back and I need to lose them. Yeah, so it's 99 there, isn't it? Yeah. So she's going to open the door. <laughs> Great. Yeah. So I get these back. Need to lose a card. Let's just lose <coughs> for now. I think. No, we'll lose that one. Give rock to It's too useful. Okay. So he hit me now, didn't he? Yeah. So he takes two wounds. Put it out. I'll retaliate that. I get max P. So he only needs one more wound, doesn't he? So, have you sorted yourself out? I'm sorted Re now. Restarted everything? Yep. Restarted your armour? No. There you go. Uh, right. So, she'll open the door. Yay. So, one, two. I'll put her there for now, but if I have to move it there, I'll move Okay. It. Uh, She's opened that door now, what happens now? Uh, we get a living bones. Yay. And an elite cultist. And because she's opened the door, we also get... There is no rest amongst these curses undead. As you kick through the door to the next room, well we didn't, you hear commotion from behind the earth. There's one of them behind us, Haley Owls. Spawn one normal cultist for two characters and two normal cultists for three or four. So a normal cultist will spawn that. Just here? Yeah. So yeah. if you've got the living bones and the elite cult, you have yeah. the bone. So he goes there and he goes there. Right. <laughs> Great. Yeah. Marvellous. Okay. Uh, I need to kill this guy next to me, that's for damn certain. Yeah. Um. But I also need to get in that room and stop him from attacking her. That's also for damn certain. Because they will, won't they? You will, yeah. Damn. I need to be everywhere at once now. Okay, so. Right, so you see me sort of making it like I'm building up a massive fart. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> like I'm about to release this massive. <laughs> okay. Um, and I'm going fairly soon to do it as well. We're not, we're not, we're not messing okay. with it. I'm going to go fairly soon yeah. and I'm going to pummel the two in front of me. Yeah. So I'm going at 35 using crushing grass, but I'm right. also using crater. I'm going at 8. So my first attack is going to be to attack and push the one in front of me. And then my next attack, I'm going to attack at range 2 yeah. and stun. Okay, so what's... I know he's only within range 1, but... So what are they moving up? Hmm? What are they moving up? Oh yeah, so cultist... And he's shuffling the cultist. Well. Oh, of course it does. Yeah, yeah thank you. That's right. Is this living bone? Yeah. Oh. It just doesn't need shuffling, does that it? Just an extra. Just that one. My bad. So move plus one and attack minus one at 25. Right. Um, cultists are moving at 39. <sighs> so they're going before us. You know, for all my No, I'm going at eight. Yeah, it's going before me. Ah. Oh. Right, so you're going first. Yeah, so I'm going to attack for two. Yeah. Um, including me, melee attack. So minus one, so yeah. two plus two is four, so that's three. Yeah. 
cut tax coming out in at number two. Mm -hmm. so that's three. Oh, he's got a shield as well, hasn't he? Yeah. So that's two. Hits. Two. Hits. Yeah. And I push him back for three. Yeah. Push him back to there. Yeah. Uh, so that's that one. And then I do have a ranged attack coming in at one. And that will stun. So I can attack him again or I can attack the cultist. Kill living bones. Kill living bones, right? Yeah, I would. Okay, so one attack coming in at him. So it's times two. Yep. Yeah. So. Times two. Times two, yeah. Uh, what's for strength is that one? One. Plus nothing. So just times two. Yeah. So it's two. Two, <laughs> yeah. How many wounds does he have left? Uh, he's got he's got three on him at the moment, hasn't he? Yeah. So that'll just one coming in at him, won't it? Because of his shield. Yeah. So he's got three on there. However, he is stunned. Stunned. That means he does nothing next that turn. That means he does nothing next turn. That goes up. Yeah. Uh, Frost goes in ascendance as well. Okay. When are the cultists moving up? Uh, 39. Okay. Uh, so this living bones needs to go, doesn't mm -hmm. he? Yes, he He's does. He's not gone. So he'll just attack me. Yeah. Minus one. Yeah. So you flip for that. Minus one. So minus two. What's his attack? Two. Two? Right. Yeah. It does nothing. It doesn't. It's fine. Right, so they moved, aren't they, first? Yeah. Yeah. But right. he's... So he's going to move to that and attack Hale. So flip. Nothing. Well, no, it's... Oh, plus. Plus. It's two it's there, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, so that's two wounds on her. I'll just stack it on top. She's got six left. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's what I didn't want to happen really. It's alright. Okay, so uh, is it me yet? Mm hmm. Fucking living bomb. Um, I'm going to launch myself into the air like I just don't care. Um, do you got one wound left? Is that number one? one. Yeah. Well, he's dead because you took an instant damage. Right, okay. Let me launch myself. I launched myself okay. four. So one, two, three, four. I'm also going to flip my boots of striding. So I'm behind these two nubs. Mm -hmm. Both of these two nubs now take one damage automatically. And I get so, an XP. It's so being epic. <laughs> what number is the cultist? Uh, three. three. He's an elite cultist. How many wounds does an elite cultist have? 12. Twelve. Joy of joys. Oh, um, what number's the. It's number three as well. Okay. So I'm going to um, literally now punch the living bones in the head. Okay. Using my crushing grasp. Trying to crush his skull. <laughs> crush fingers. Oh, Plus one. Uh, so that's four damage to him. So he's dead. Minus one. Minus one, so he's Three damage. Yeah. And that goes into ascendance. Should that drop? Did that go into ascendance this turn? I can't remember. Yeah, it did, didn't it? He's got one wound left. Yes, he has. So I still need to go to my discard pile. Right, and then it's uh, the cultists. Mm -hmm. So I'll move minus, minus one. one. What's the move? His move is um, two. So one. Um, the other two don't move. Right. And attacking. Yep. Uh, and then do self heals, don't we? Mm -hmm. uh, so number two's next, next to you. Mm hmm. Do you want to flip? Plus two. Oh, mercy. Uh, although. You got you. Yeah, so. Oh. Next two sources of damage from attacks targeting you, gain one shield. Yeah. So, I'll still take a hit, won't I? Yeah. Yeah, I'll take a hit. Why well, you take? Three damage. Three damage? Yeah. Oh, I can't take that then. Just discard a card instead. Oh no. Take this card that 
woman. And then the cultist next to me, the elite one. Mm -hmm. I'm flipping for that. Minus, Minus one. one. So, so the elite cultist. Two. two. So one damage. One damage. I can live. Okay. So they've gone. Mm -hmm. We've gone. Mm -hmm. Now she goes. So she'll move to the door and <laughs> open the door for us. No. Good on her. Yeah. Thanks. So in the next room. <laughs> oh, this is ridiculous. Uh, we need an elite living corpse. And that's it. One elite living corpse. Yeah. And three gas traps. Really? <laughs> uh, I don't I can move that up there. You're not gonna like what happens next. Why? Uh, something spawn on where I'm stood. Yeah. Great. You can't, because you're stood on it. So I'll spawn next to you. Right, okay. It's a living spirit. Oh, no, I'm joking. Man. Yeah. Is it an elite or a normal? I know. I think you need to run out of this. <laughs> yeah. So that's going to spawn there, isn't it? Yeah. Right. And that's going to have to go in there. It's on the next turn. Right. What do I have? Right. So, <clears throat> that living bones attacked me before, didn't it? Not did. keeping track of this. Did the cultists attack me as well? I can't remember. No, the living bones attacked because it was the cultists that attacked me. So that cultist needs two wounds on him, by the way. Which one is he? Uh, the three. elite one. He's number three. In this case, I'm just gonna scurry. Yeah. Yeah. How many ways does this loving corpse thing have? Lots. It's not any special rules, on, does it? It's just a meat bag. Yeah, it's just a meat bag. Right, okay. Shove them into the uh, traps. That's what I wanna do. <laughs> <laughs> Well, if I can get through that, I could make him walk into one of them as long as I've not used that ability. Mm -hmm. Hey. I don't really know what to do. Move to heal one. Are you going pretty early or what? Uh, pretty early. Yeah. Yeah. Let's, uh, yeah, let's do that. And are you all right for wounds and stuff? Are you all right? Um, I should be. Cool. Right. Just 
slung this guy in the face. Okay. Okay. So I'm going it? sort of mid to late round. Right. Um, um, I'm hoping to go quite early on. Yep. See what these guys are doing? Yep. The cultist is going on 63. Yep. And he's going to summon <sighs> Living Bones. Living Bones is going on 45. Yeah. Is it Living Corpse? Yeah. 66. He's going on 66. And then we've got this dude who's going on 48. <laughs> You're just getting out of there, aren't you? Hmm? You're just I'm, out. I'm just going to get out of there, yeah. So I'm going on 11. Uh, okay. I'm going on 57. Okay. So I'm going to guess the living bones are going before me. Mm. Really not. Actually, that might be helpful in this case. So you're going first, aren't you? Yeah, so yeah. I'm going to move the two and heal two. So yeah. on two. Yeah. Heal two. And then I'm going to move for three yeah. uh, and attack one if I'm in range of anyone. One, two, three. Oh, you keep on there. Two, three. And attack the living bone. Yeah. He's only got one wing left as well. He has, hasn't he? So, that would be quite useful if you could kill him. Yeah, so. Um, if not, don't worry too much. Yeah, so I'm attacking on one plus two. Yeah. So times two. Yeah, he's dead. Dead. <laughs> dead. Smash. Yep. Right. And uh, we'll drop a coin there. Yeah. Good job. Um. What I was going to do was shove him out of the way and go and heal her for a one. <laughs> I can't see the, li the living corpse from where I am, not going to. No, you can't. No, and they're out of range. Don't leave me with a great deal of options, to be honest. We'll punch him in the face. <laughs> this, okay. This cultist. Right. That's, that's what I'm going to do. Crunch. Um, plus nothing. So that's three damage he takes. And he gets pushed back to the magnetic speed. And then I'm going to move to the okay. which heals her for one. And do you have any wounds? Are you alright? Uh, I'm alright, I'm full. Yeah. Yeah. So it would. Uh, you me as well. And that's it, there's no Jason enemy, so they don't get attacked. So who goes next on here? So it's Living Bones. Living Bones. I've yeah, gone. For, the, the, they're 45. They're 45? Yeah. So him. Yeah. Just him. Just him on his tod. What's the movement? Uh, the movement is um, three. So one, two, three. He's dead, isn't he? Yeah, so that's that one done. And um, then um, living spirit. This is moving. I haven't got living spirit out, that's <laughs> why. Put living spirit on there. His yeah. movement is um, three. Three. One. Two, three. Yep. What's his attack? Two. Two. Yes. So he's going to attack me, isn't yeah. he? So plus one, that's three. Three. Although, I'll get my shield. So that's two. That's two coming at me. Yep. I'll have to take it. <laughs> OK. 
Okay, this is the bit I've not been looking forward to. Cultists. So he summons a yeah. living bones, he gets two damage on him. They summon living bones. Oh yeah. Plural. Because there's three of them. There's three of them now, isn't there? <laughs> so... And they all take two damage. Yeah. So starting with, uh, what's the highest? Number one? two. Number two is this guy. Is he a bog, bog standard dude? Yeah. Well he's dead, he's just killed himself. So he's dead and then living bones turns up. So I'll use this living bones. Alright, okay. Yep. Yep. And then number three, the elite. Three. The elite he's already got these wounds on him. He's got he? six wounds. Six yeah. wounds, so he's There's another two wounds are added to him. Yeah. And then I need a little living bones model. And then number four will take two wings. Yep. Oh, we need another living bones. Yep. This. Great. Ah, uh, this is getting out of hand. It is. Yeah. Okay. So, starting again, don't we? Uh, oh. Corpse guy. Oh, corpse guy, yeah. He just moves, the attack, what's his movement? Uh, corpse is one. one. So he just lumbers to the. Right, okay. Right. right. I'm going to try and snipe that bloody cultist, so I don't want to summon anything else. Um. Right. I want to use some ranged attacks then. Right, I'm rumbling in balance. Yeah, I'm going to do a shift 29. I'm going to go for the initiative in 9. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So do we need to see what they're going at? That needs shuffling. Uh, that needs shuffling. Yeah. The living corpse needs shuffling, so I'll shuffle that one. And pull the top card. The fuck? <laughs> Sorry, I just saw that stuff on there. What's going on? They don't need shuffling that one. Sorry. I should have gone to that. This one doesn't need shuffling, no. right? Just move that out of the way. Okie dokie. Um, What's your initiative? Nine. 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 I'm 29. Right, so. So you, the living corpse, the cultists, me, and everything else. <clears throat> yeah. So what I'm hoping to do is. Um, Force an enemy within range five to perform an attack of two. Yeah. So, what would you reckon the uh, living bones on the cultist? Yeah. Right. That's so, awesome. living bones. Yeah. He's gonna. Let's flip. Flip. It's like minus two. <sighs> Nothing. Nothing. So that's wasted. Um, and then I've got an attack of two with a range of four, and it'll immob immobilise. So, what do you reckon's more? Not all immobilise. Uh, immobilise the living dude. The corpse. living corpse. Yeah, immobilise him. Right, so um, attacking. Yeah. So no, no, I didn't do anything. Oh, why are the cards doing this to <laughs> Does he still get immobilised though? Uh, uh, or is it only if he hits? Uh, is, it no, is it a nullified attack? It's a nullified attack, so yeah, it won't. Let me double check. Oh man, it's going very wrong. Surrounded, right numbered. Yeah. 
and I'm going to have to take a, a rest or use my potion and get two cards back and then take a rest. There's no damage you've done by the attack, so I think okay. he's still mobilised. So, Might be wrong. So that. he's mobilised. Uh, Frost goes up as well. And Frost? Yeah, me. XP's gone up. <laughs> Okie dokie. That's me hmm. done. Yeah. Right. Okay. So will she, on purpose, walk into that trap, do you think? <laughs> yeah, she, she's going to move too. She's annoying. It's like any other escort quest, mm. though. It's like, you just wish you could knock them out and then drag them there yourself. Yes. Right, okay. How many wounds is a living, that thing next to you up? Which one? The thing that's next to me? The living spirit. Uh, two. But it's shielded. Yeah. Right, I'm going to lob a massive boulder out of that cultist. cultist. Yeah. <laughs> Slam. Range three attack. Does three. the cultist not go before you, though? Yeah, it's it 27. does. Because it's 27. So um, they move. Uh, what's the movement? Movement is... Um, Two. Two, so I can't do that attack now at all. Uh, and attack. Attack is. Two. Two. Damn it. So you'll move two as well, won't you? Yeah. Uh, attack is two, so do you want to flip? Times two. Times two. Uh, so. Four. Yeah, we'll take all the damage. Oh, okay. Shuffle. And he takes two damage in his face from my retaliate. And also, I an XP. Who's that, the? The big cultist guy. Just took two damage in his face. Right, so that's five, ten he's on. Ten, got two yeah. wins left. Yeah. Right. In that case, I'm just going to punch him in the face because there's nothing else I can do now he's moved into contact with me. Okay. So I'm just going to use massive boulder instead of doing what I was going to do and just hit him. Right. Uh, which is at minus one. So does a wound. Which is useless. <laughs> just one wound. Yeah, just one wound. Uh, leaves me in a bit of a quandary. Uh, I don't want to move anywhere. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. What I'll do, I'll move one, two, and then he takes one damage from a rumbling advance, which kills him. Yep. Yeah. Dead. Drop a coin. Where's the coin go? Just that. Right. No, it's next. the living spirit. Living spirit. Which is so a moves minus me. one attacks plus one. Frost should be there. And stunned. Damn it. So he'll stun you if it <laughs> Right. If it attacks successfully. So its attack is two. Yep. Yeah. Plus one, which is three. You have to rest next turn anyway, yeah. you said, didn't you? So it's irrelevant. So it's plus one. Plus one. You got any cards in your hand? One. One. I'll just discard that. Well, discard, not lost. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so you're stunned, but you're not, you're only going to rest anymore. Yeah. yeah. And then it's, um, to everyone. Living bones. 
living bones. So they move how many? Was it three did you uh, say? Living bones. Are moving three. Three, yeah. Zero. Was he that? I think it was One, two, three. Yeah, well, uh, Can he move through his? Yeah, because oh, they're right. allies. Oh, and he's going to move as well. One, two, three. Yeah. So. What about that one? The other one? Yeah, isn't he? One, two, three. Mobbed. We're going to get mobbed. Yeah. Uh, so, one by one's against me. So, do you want to flip? Nope. Nope. Uh, I'm going to have to shuffle because I'm And then the next one is against you, number two. Plus one? No, plus zero, so. So, whatever his best attack is. Which is two. Two, two dues. Two damage. I have to take it because I've nothing else. Yeah. Oh, really low on health. And then. The shield move. So, one, two. Into the poison trap. Mm -hmm. So, is it poisoned? Oh, it's a stun. No, it's not a stun trap. One on one. It's a, it's a damage trap times three of those. So, we're on level two. Mm -hmm. she, she takes four damage. That puts her on five. Three wins mm -hmm. left. She's gonna get herself killed. Basically. Does she not get poisoned? Uh, it didn't say poison. Did All it? right. Okay. Hang on. Damage trap. Oh, damage trap. Just a damage trap. Right. Okay. 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 You're you're resting, aren't you? I have to. So that, that uh, will come off now, that. Yeah. Well, he's going to go after her and kill her. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'll probably get killed right away because I've only got three health left. You've got three health left. Yeah. And I can't move. This this is this, this is ending badly, this one, I can tell. This is the first real big fail we've had. Um, after the first attempt. Mm. Um, uh, See, I can immobilise everyone, but I can't move them away from me. Unless I use my minor stamina potion to get two cards back, and then move. Uh, but even if I move, I'm still going to be moving into, into, the, living corpse. into the living corpse, so yeah. I might as well just stay where I am. Can heal you for two. Man, there's just so few options left before I, I have to actually stop as well. Um, I can just slam them with the dirt turn here, I suppose. Mother one at least. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. So you're going to 99 anyway, aren't you? Yeah. I'm going to 38. What are they, these arseholes doing? So, they're going on 48. The Living Spirit's going on 48. Yeah. Cultist is going on 27. Living Corpse is going on 66. Yeah. Living Bones is going on 25. Living bones are gonna go first then. It's not what I wanted to happen. They're too quick then, mm. guys. Okay, so what are living bones doing? Move plus one move and then minus attack. one to attack. So this guy's not gonna move, he's just gonna attack me. Right. So I'm gonna flip. Yes, it's minus one to attack, so no. So, so one wound. One wound coming in at you. That's so seven. And number two. He's gonna attack me. Yeah. Plus one. Two wounds. Two wounds. 
I have nothing to save myself, so. You're down to one. I'm down to one. Damn it. Uh, this guy's going to move normally, is it? Mm -hmm. Move plus one, though, isn't it? So one, two, three, four. So he'll move to the. Oh, he not moved to there. To that, mm. he would run here, so then he'll attack you. Yeah, that's it. No one attack. Was that nullified attack? Nullified attack. Yeah, I'll do. Keep us alive for one second longer. Oh no! I need you not to be stood where you're stood. <laughs> well, <laughs> the only thing I can do is use that and get two cards back. Yeah. But I should have used it by now. Yeah. So. It's too late. So is, is it me next? Well, what, what are you on? 38. The cultists are going to move. Is cultists. There, is there any cultists knocking around? Just him. So he's going to move normally. Yep. So two, one, yep. two. That's it for him. Yep. And then it's you. And it's me. Yep. I think you're going to have to do what you need to do, Chuck. To be fair, if you need to throw that attack and you... you it press, will kill you. Yeah, but if you can still get through the dungeon, if you can... I'm not sure I can do it on my own. I'm going to die anyway. So. She's going to open that door at the end of this yeah. turn. So whatever's through there is going to come through on us anyway. I think this is... Well, whatever you, whatever you don't do, I'm still going to get attacked by this living spirit. So if it's whatever true. you do doesn't pull off, I'm dead anyway. Yeah. Well, either way, I'm going to cop it. Yeah. So do as much damage as you can. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to have to, I think. <laughs> well, the, pro the problem I've got is I'm stood right next to them as well, so I have to move first. Mm. <sighs> Living bonds have all gone though, haven't they? Mm. Just this living spirit on the living right. corpse. I can hit these two using my AoE effect. Like bang onto that. I'll give it a shot. Just hitting these two. You sure? Yeah, and then it does absolutely nothing to them. It's only one attack. It's nothing. Uh, so I'm going to throw two heal on you, so you get two wounds back. Okay. Oh no. <laughs> right, who's not gone? So, after you, yeah. it was Living Spirit. Yeah, so it's used his turn, is it? Yeah, so he's going to attack, attack me. Yeah. For minus one. What's his attack? Spirit. Is two. Oh, one wound. One wound. Yeah. Is that it? Uh, and then living corpse. He's going to move. Move. And he moves one. Yep. And he'll attack hell. Yep. What's uh, flip? For nothing, what's his normal attack? He's not late. Three. She's dead. No, four. She's dead. Even, yeah. Get him on it. <laughs> I thought we were going to die first, but yeah. no, nope, you got to... There we go, so, escort mission failed. Right, um, I didn't get any money again. Uh, I did get 7 XP though, what did you get? Um, I, I got 5. 7 XP I didn't have. Um, did we get the XP from the last dungeon we did, by the way? No. We should have got 8 XP for that. From the last dungeon? Yeah. Yeah. 
you didn't get. Do I still get this coinage here? Yes, you, yeah. keep, you keep everything you've got. So that's plus six. Uh, we're technically both exhausted though. Right. That's so. my second hit. Uh, we failed the mission. Uh, so I should have been on 91 on the last one. So what I've got this game, seven points, will actually level me up. Oh, excellent. So I'll take me to 98. So I will actually level up. I'm on, I'm on 92, so I'm just Ooh. a couple off from levelling up to Ooh. level 3. Right, well, that's a fail. I'm going to try it again. I'm going to go back to Gloomhaven first. I think we should go back to Gloomhaven, to be quite honest, mm -hmm. and uh, lick our wounds. Yeah, and cry a little bit. So we'll go back to the Gloomhaven and. Uh, so there's, there's nothing really to update on the map because we didn't accomplish anything. No. So, um, we'll probably... Are we going to do this mission again? I don't know. I don't know if we should try it again or whether we should to try go, something else try first. something else. Because obviously it's going to be level three, is it? Yeah, because I'll level up. And I've not leveled up. So yeah. I'm going to be at a disadvantage now. Mm. Right, okay. So... When we come back, I will be level three, and we'll decide whether we're going to come back to this dungeon, mm -hmm. or we're going to uh, go to another dungeon. Yeah. Okay, so uh, we'll see you guys next time. We'll see you soon. Bye for now. <laughs> <laughs>